Mary, you're gonna learn today, girl. No physical discipline. Mom. Don't mom me, no. You had your warning, you had your chance. I told you to listen. I told you stop disobeying my rules. I told you being cute ain't shit. If you have no education. What's going on, everybody? What's going on? Welcome, welcome to another great, you know what day. Well, it's the man, JP, Mr. Nobody, and I'm back again on my Calm Vibe moment. So, have you all seen this? Where this young lady, or this mother, felt the best punishment for her daughter is to go live and cut all her hair off. Mothers, what the H are y'all doing? Has it come to this? That you have to show people, well, I'm disciplining her, even though she acts out because kids act out. But to go online or go live and do what you did and then think that you're not traumatizing her. Check this shit out, people. Check this out. But before you do, make sure you hit that thumbs up, that notification, and subscribe to the channel, people. Help a brother out. Now. Let's jump to it. Come here. You're going to learn today, girl. No physical discipline. Mom. Don't mom me. No. You had your warning. You had your chance. I told you to listen. I told you stop disobeying my rules. I told you being cute ain't shit. If you have no education, I told you stop disobeying me. I told you to listen and do as you're supposed to. I told you to do good in school. I told you to do your daily routine and you yet to even do any of it. And you thought you were disobeying me today and I was not coming to cut this hair off. You're sadly mistaken because you thought being pretty was so much better than being educated or listening to your mom, right? Yes, this is what happens when you don't listen to your mom. The crazy thing is today, I had to do something that like, I really didn't want to do, but I had to do to teach my child a lesson. We try to be better than our parents and I try really hard to be the best mother that I can be. Okay, you see, that was extreme. And you see how long the young lady hair is. Her hair was down here. I mean, she's been growing this hair all her life. And you just cut it off. You didn't even style it. You just nicked it up. And then you come back and do a video explaining what you did all dolled the fuck up with filters. And you telling her you got to be more than just pretty. You got red hair, filter on, got these fucking eyelashes kicking up like this. But you're telling your daughter, don't look like me on here. I don't know what she's been doing, but in school, but all this shit you've been doing. And then she maybe she trying to look like you because she had red hair too. Now, this is the funny part. Y'all watch this shit. This is the funny part. Then she's going to make her sit there and do this fucking hostage video. Check this shit out. That I can be. Hi. Do you feel traumatized? No. Do you feel like I abused you? No. Do you feel like this form of discipline was a lot better than any other form of discipline, like physical abuse that I could have used? Yes. You know I love you, right? Yes. You know I got your back, right? Yes. You know what I'm doing right now is to make you a better person, right? Yes. How many times have I spoken to you about this? A lot of times. How many times have your teachers called me? Multiple times. How many times? So. <laughs> now, the daughter may have been doing some shit on the internet or on social media or whatever in class, but you took the cake with this one. You pretty much did a hostage video. You made her sit there. Look at that camera. And answering, you better answer these questions right, too. Did I do this to you? No. Did I do this? No. Did I beat you? No. Do I traumatize you? No. Was this traumatizing? No. Was this for the better of you? Yeah. 
Because if she said no, what else would she may have done to her? So I'm going to say this to you mothers, and I've been hearing it a lot with daughters say they're traumatized. And we always say that some of these mothers traumatize their kids. I know we talk about they manipulate the men, their sons, but y'all do this to your women, your daughters. There's no reason to do what you did to punish her. There's nothing that you did that can make her curve what she's doing. You didn't cut her hair now. So, so what else you going to punish her with? Black her eye? Shave her eyebrows off? I mean, what else you going to do? You done did the ultimate. That does not curve behavior. Maybe she need to see a therapist. Where's her father? Maybe she need to go talk to her father if he's not deceased. And if he's deceased, then maybe she need to see a therapist. But take it upon yourself to embarrass her on social media and call that a form of punishment? See, that's some bullshit right there. And that's what I understand. Some of y'all, y'all, I tell you what, man. Someone explain this shit to me. You mothers, because y'all like to say shit anyway. Explain to me how cutting her hair is can curve her behavior. I want you to hit it up in the comments when I post this shit. Explain to me, because I'm a guy, I don't get it, by cutting her hair she's grown all her life because she's going through a spell as a young teenager, which they do. Wait till she hit another spurt when she get about 18, 17, or 18. That's what they do. And anybody that had kids that grown, raised them to adults, you know they go through phases. But Y'all let me know, man. I ain't gonna chat about this shit no more. All I can say is some of y'all mothers, y'all need to do better than this shit here. Social media is not the way you go and correct behaviors and any other problem. Stop going to social media to get some claps so people think you a good mother because the word got out your daughter acting out in class. So I'm showing the world that I'm a good mother. So I'm gonna punish you on social media. Man, this is stupid. And y'all stupid for doing it. Anybody that do this to your child, you need to get your ass. Uh, what um, Dr. Umar say, you need about 10 lashings. That's what you need. Well, guys, this me, JP, always known as Mr. Nobody. I'm up here doing it again, saying something that y'all don't like, but who gives a crap, right? And I'm up out of here. Make sure you subscribe, hit that like and notification, and I'm up out of here. Talk about it, people. Peace.